Right, I should be streaming. Yay, I am online and welcome back to Taylor Aerospace. Right, I think before we left, what's our milestones? Where did we learn? We've broken a land distance record. Orbit into the surface from orbit. Okay. Right. So we want a MUN flyby, don't we? That's the main thing we want. So if we open our orbit ship, it's a nice ship. Oh, yeah, I got really confused, didn't I? Yeah, I remember that now. Um, oh, right, yeah, that, okay. Okay, um... Well... This will be interesting. Okay, so I've got a part restriction here, which is... Frustrating. I think if I launch this, I can gather more science, land it somewhere. And we'll be alright. Oh, good. <laughs> alright, let's go. I am not sure about this thing at all. Well, it moves. Okay, I've got my prograde and retrograde markers now. That's good. At least I've got that. Can we turn a little bit further? I mean, I, I, I'm gaining some height here. No. This is as far over as I can turn. But okay, it's not bad, it's not bad. Let's attach those. Let's see if we can flip over a little bit. We can. Uh, a little bit too far for my liking. I mean, this has gone horribly wrong. But... I think we can fix it. I think we can fix it, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Oh, yeah, we are into orbit here. Okay. Kill it. Oh, do we have manoeuvre nodes now? Oh, look at that. Lovely. Let's pull that in a little bit. Securize that orbit. And we do not have enough. I mean, fine. Don't really matter to me. Um... I'm kind of just happy doing it wherever we can. Wait, where are my... Where are my action groups?
There used to be an action group thing. Oh, uh, hang on. Is this something I need to unlock? Okay, that's not too bad. It was an awful launch, but fine. Let's dump that. Open. Oh, open. Okay. Observe mystery gear. Oh, fine. That's not helpful, is it? Let's conduct materials. Keep experiment. Can we do a crew report? We can. Oh, look at that. We can EVA now. Isn't that beautiful? EVA report. We'll take the data. We can board. Let's close all these doors. Point ourselves retrograde. Kill that. And fast forward. Because that's it, we're done. Alright, the parachutes are already engaged. When we start burning up a little bit more, I'll pull us in. There we go. I'm not doing too bad. This is this is a heavy ship, though. Heavy, heavy ship. I mean, we are just punching through that atmosphere. Yeah, we are. Wow. Well, yes, we're losing height very, very quickly. And still, in fact, going very, very fast. Um, I mean, I'm hoping this will work. I'm guessing it will. So, yeah. Has this got sound? I'm guessing it will. So... Have to double check that. I'm not sure this is recording the desktop audio. Um, there we go. That hopefully should have done um. it. There we go. I mean, not like you need sound for Kerbal that much anyway, but I apologise if anyone starts watching this and wonders where the sound was. That's going to completely have screwed up my thing, hasn't it? Alright, let's speed this up. Drug shoots are out. Is this going to slow this down enough? Because we're still going pretty fast here. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Um, it's bad enough that I'm going to pull him out and collect the data. Okay. 
just in case this blows up. So okay, it's not. I could probably do with having myself some actual parachutes on this, not just not just the drogue ones. Oh, we're okay. Sweet. Eighty nine science. So resource transfer available, curve leaders can have quite science. Uh, unknown object tracking. Conform ETS and place flags. Light planning available. Um, okay. Oh yeah, there you go. Basic action groups. Right. Okay. Okay. So I really need to do that then, don't I? I need money, man. Unless. Oh no, because I only have a 30 part limit, don't I? Okay. What's this flea one then? Juno. Okay, radio mount parachute. Kerbin flying. Student speed. mount parachutes and what does it need? Third liquid engines, players and bear Kerbin flying. Okay. Oh, hang on, how do I Okay. 
That was actually not a bad launch, I don't think, personally. Again, I'm not getting into all of this. I can get high, but I cannot get into orbit. There's not enough. There's not enough room. Yeah, it's too much. to be able to get into orbit with this. Jab. We can do this, pal. We can do this. Are we going to be able to get to orbit? We've got our map. We are in orbit. Brilliant. Pressure data doesn't work. Yeah, I've done all this, haven't I? Okay. EVA you, sir? Closer, if away. Let's 
fast forward a little bit. It's only a four second like ding, isn't it? So Okay. Let's walk round and see if we can't get ourselves a crew report. How am I still so far off? Wow, I'm really far off. I don't I don't know what's happened there. But I am gonna have to pull myself in now though. Let's try and get this on here, shall we? Bye. No. No, I'm not going to be able to get this as an opportunity, am I? Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Let's just try landing. Easy enough. Right. Close and let's just go. There's no more to it, unfortunately. I can test the thud liquid fuel engine. That's frustrating though, you've got to be going at a really low speed. Are the things are like, I don't know whether I'm going to be able to slow down to that sort of a speed though, in that time frame. I mean, hopefully I can. I mean, Jeb's having a lovely time again. We check our. We're going to be off, but. Oh, I am. S the reason it was off because the planet's all spinning. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. Wow, I'm an idiot. Come on, Jeb. It's all right, mate. It's all right. You're okay, buddy. Looks like we're going to be landing in the ocean, sir. All right, let's land down. Let's land down. So there's a nice wide arc as well. So hopefully I can slow down to that sort of a speed. Uh, yeah, at least it's a very low speed. Like I won't hit that. Hopefully I slow down to more than that, though. The, like this is the bit that I, I will start absolutely plummeting now. Oh, 
Check us all those. Can I slow down enough? Uh, the answer is no. I mean, even without, oh my, even without the heat shield, I can barely slow down to that speed. That is very slow. Let's go with the very slow speed. Oh, yeah, go on then. Let's do our... Uh, have we got anything here? Oh, we have. Get a crew report. Oh, we can. The EVA. All right, that's pretty sweet. Okay, uh, let's speed that up so we can actually land within the next millennium. Kerbal's water always looks so bad, doesn't it? I really should apply some some texture mods onto this. Let's recover that vessel. Right. Nice, nice, nice. Got myself a lot of science there. Um, so the question is, do do I grab one of these bigger ones, like the 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 big rockets, or at least the big fuel tanks? I don't think so, to be honest. Although that would allow me to do asparagus. Do that. Hang on. That, that is not enough. Okay, cookies. And slap those on. Can only have six more parts. See, this is where it gets difficult, isn't it? This is where it gets difficult. So we do have big, all oh, big stuff, big lots of fuel. Not really have the engines to, to take it though. And 
that you can join them. Let me make sure they're on the thing. Okay, what are we on? 25. It's doable. There we go. So we need to make sure they all fire at the same time. Um, and since we can get away with it, let's give it some aerodynamics. Alright, okay. Do we get any structural? No. Alright, let's launch. I'm not sure how well this one will do. The other one, you know, we got a big boost out of it, which is nice. So hopefully this one, we can do the same. Okay, I mean, it's fast. It's definitely fast. Way too fast, in fact. Hurt right, that flight. <laughs> Again, we'll start turning. You can gain speed very, very quickly. It's not particularly stable though. stable. I don't really know what to do with it otherwise because I can't add any wings unless I just start doing these. I could just start doing these. Well, that didn't go right, did it? Well, I wonder if this will get me my radial parachutes, because I'm not going anywhere near as fast as previously, although I am gaining speed quite dramatically. But uh... I'm not sure I'm going to have enough time here. Speed was far too fast again. Okay, 
I'm going to revert this flight. I don't think I need the... If I'm not going for science, I don't really need all this, do I? Let's make that lighter. Let's pull this off. Okay, so this gives me a bit more freedom. Okay. So, I should be able to do the parachutes on that one. The thud liquid fuel engine. flying at a very specific altitude and speed. So I can go up here. Okay. Let's launch. Not much like a payload. That should help with the other one. I just need money. I can easily get to the moon if I could just Build a bigger ship. Burn these solid rockets because they get me immense amounts of speed and height. Alright, hold true, Jab. Come on, we've got this, pal. We have got this. Turn retrograde. Because I'm slowing down. Okay. Uh, what is it? 56. Speed's right. That's... That's right, though. What's going on, man? There you go. 
Oh, come on. I don't... Okay. Uh, let's revert flight. Let's move those up. I'll put it here. Okay, launch. Not sure what happened there, if I'm completely honest. gonna blast straight through that ceiling and immediately turn myself retrograde which will become easier to do when I'm a little bit higher up uh, wind resistance hit me I'm losing speed it's good it's good Okay, let's speed things up a little. So, we're in the 56 range. Approaching my apolapsis. Still got 40 seconds to slow down, though. Outside of my epilapsis now. Yeah, I'm outside of the thing. So let's, let's allow him to pull back into that, past the apilapsis. So all the way down. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, let's... <laughs> Should be fun. That's totally doable though, if I perform an actual proper test. I'll try and get over the Richmond Solitude as well. I don't think I need that main parachute, do I? 
It's already slow enough as it is. Oh, that parachute. Oh, so that will almost achieve the same thing. If I can just slow down quicker. Much quicker. That's what I'll try on my next one then. Let's see whether that can work. All oh, right, nearly landed. Taking its time. I think you can get better warp mods, but again this is just, I'm trying to do this completely mod free, just in case people do like what I'm doing and want to follow along, they can. You don't need to put any mods on at all, this just works vanilla. Recover that. I didn't do any science there, but that wasn't the point. I'm just trying to get some money. Okay. Uh, no, I need to take those off. I don't I don't need those, do I? Alright, I just need to get those to be slow. I do a crew report, so I need to get into orbit. Okay. I think this can get me into orbit. It did it once before. Yeah, because assuming I'm not pratting around, it's it's actually is pretty good, so. Immediately hard turnover. higher up you start getting with this, the harder that's going to be. So, let's pull that out so I can see what I'm doing with my F-boxes. Uh, solid fuel's about two-thirds of the way down. Uh, roughly coming to that 45 degree angle that I want. When you hit about 10,000 meters high, release. Start. A little bit more. Oh, we are going very fast. Right, there we go. I mean, it's not the best, but frankly. With some of the limitations I've got right now, I'm I'm happy with that. Yeah, it's not very good actually, is it? But that does get me into orbit, and I have enough to get me into orbit. So I'm happy with that. And I just need to get myself into Richmond Solitude. Right. Okay, and burn. This is actually a very... I'm only 0.1 degree off, just being a completely equatorial. That ain't bad. the darkness.
bigger. Okay, it wasn't the best. But it's got the job done. I just need to use my maneuver node now to just get myself over that area. I mean, that's not going to be that far, surely, is it? Ah, stop, go back. Oh, I wish I had some more maneuver notes than this. Okay. Right, uh, boom, run out. Awesome. Crew report done. Oh, brilliant. Right. Uh, now land. I want to land on the light. I don't, I don't like landing in the dark. It bothers me. Right. There we go. Boom. Uh, go back to this. What do you reckon? Oh, I that's pretty spot on, man. Okay, let's go. Let's focus retrograde. I am actually going to keep my engine as well, just to be able, if it if it survives, to be able to slow myself down a little bit. Okay, I can see the Kerbal Space Center. Oh, it's starting to overheat. Oh, 
although I am slowing down rapidly. Come on! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, I think I might have actually done it. Yeah, that didn't work, did it? Uh, I think the weight was an issue there. Alright, never mind. Let's speed that up again. Not far from the Kerbal Space Centre. Right, so I think I actually did myself a disservice there by keeping that. The weight of it dragged it down. I think if I'd just flown it as a normal pod, I think I might have actually been able to pull that off better. And we will slowly descend to the surface. Taking its time. Just being nice and... Uh, refreshing. And we're nearly there. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we'll see if there's any other things going on. Uh, oh, I just managed to pull that in. Okay. I've got some funds, not all of them, which is kind of frustrating because I really need to upgrade that. But I've got science, so what can I do with my science? Definitely not that. Uh, Airline flight, don't really need that. I suppose I could get the strut connector. Get that. What have we got here? Some parachutes. Skipper. Hmm. Try that. Bobcat. No. They're all too frustrating. That one is doable. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No. Okay. Uh, is there any? Yeah, there is. We could make some. Structural changes. These, just to make it a little safer, you know. Okay. Get five more parts on this. Ah, what did it want me to do?
crew report skipper. Right. Oh, okay. specific set of things to do as well. Alright. Okay. Yeah, this is a little bit stronger now. Be able to hold together a little bit more. Right. If I can get it into orbit, it's fine. Oh, right, okay. Approaching that 45 degree angle. Again, this isn't going to be the best takeoff. I'm limited by the parts I can have. I don't know, maybe I should do some smaller ones. Doing a setup. I'm really not sure what would be best at this point. We are going so fast. Well, that was easy. Okay. Um. Let's flatten this out. Might as well try just to land, I suppose. Yeah, I suppose actually I could just try and land. Slow down. Come on, before I hit 6,000. You know what? Let's... Oh no, let's let this one land. Because I did get that Verna's one, and I don't want to mess that up. But otherwise... Okay, let's try the skipper fuel engine as well. How do we get to that height and get such a low speed, though? And I will add more parachutes. I think that might be a shout. A right, pain in the bum, but... Trying to land, because it will be very, very slow. But I don't really know what else to do at this stage. <laughs> Coming in for a landing. 
Still 400 meters out. Recover that. Um, blow, blow. They're too annoying. I, I can't be asked with all. I don't know, actually. Oh, just a poodle engine. It was really specific, isn't it? That's above. That one could be done. Let's take that one. Okay. Oh uh, no 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 no! I want to add some new parachutes, don't I? Drogues maybe. Yeah, let's add a load of drogues. They can slow it down, can't they? launch then. Get myself into orbit. Try and fiddle around with these temperature recordings. Is that what they are? Above. Oh, it's pressure readings. Okay, I need... I'm going to need myself uh, an Atmogen thing then, aren't I? Okay, yeah, barometer, there we go. I can just um, stick that there. This part limit, man, is so annoying. I forgot how irritating career mode can be. Right, try this again. Take myself over. For some reason, ever since I had the struts, I don't know if it's an aerodynamic issue, but I am getting some ever so slightly off course with them. This wasn't a good. This wasn't a good flight. I should have been far more at an angle by now, rather than just virtually straight up. The mind.
Okay, that's not too bad. That's not too bad, actually. I can get my orbit line to intersect. Be that far out. Even further, I don't need to be that far out. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to have enough Delta V in general. Which is going to be kind of frustrating, but okay. I can try. Oh, bugger, 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 bugger. See, that's, that's what happens when you push forward. Look at my tiny little ship, isn't it cute? Absolutely not getting away with that. No. Okay. Doable. Right, get off that. Yeah, it's not far enough of it, is it? That's what I've managed to achieve. Oh, this might not go well. But I'm dedicated. I'm dedicated. I'm not I'm not just gonna jump back on this one. Come on, I've got my parachutes. We'll see how this goes. I'm still very high up. My ablator should last a very long time. I don't need an electric charge anymore. We have broken an altitude record. We have broken a land distance record. We have an altitude record of 70 kilometers. We have reached space. We have a land distance record of 100 kilometers. We have entered orbit. We have returned to the surface from orbit. We have performed a spacewalk in orbit. Okay. My well, Burning upness is working so far. I might. No, I'm not going to. I think this is it. I think I'll. I think I'm going to be pulled in. Oh. 
Okay. So, this was an incredibly shallow angle of descent. Hopefully, with all the extra parachutes, this will slow me down in time. I mean, this is the one I'm worried about, because this is an even higher altitude. Big one. Right there. Okay, that was uh didn't get high enough for that. I did get for that. Okay, so I could just adjust the that's the that's the main parachute, isn't it? Oh, but that it doesn't matter what it is, as long as it's there. That's a lot of parachutes. This is, this is going to take me a while to get down to the ground. But at least I'll, I know I'll be nice and safe when I do. A lovely four meters a second. Lovely. Let's take our time with this one. Let's check on my stream. Everything seems to be going okay. Have I dropped any? I haven't dropped any frames. I've got a great connection speed. Even my temps, actually, my GPU temp was going a bit berserk, should we say, earlier. Um, at least it's calmed down a little bit now. Alright, let's recover that. At least we, we have knocked a couple of things out here. Okay. Right. Any oh, other man. interesting contracts? So we've got no Bobcat Poodle. No, screw those. Right. So we do need to do this. We just need to have the parachutes launch higher up. Yeah, that should be fine. Fly by the man. Take pressure readings. Should be fine. Should be able to knock both of these out if I'm good and lucky. Should be able to knock both of these out. Let's wait till morning. I don't like flying in the dark. It doesn't look good on stream, does it? Let's be honest. Right. Let's go. Let's tip over a lot heavier and a lot faster this time. That's much better. So it's definitely an unusual amount of parachutes, but I 
can't seem to get it to go that slow at that height though. And so if I can get a really good takeoff as well, like right, that's absolutely brilliant news for getting myself into orbit. go that it's not great is it that's my ship oh there he is <laughs> no turn back up turn back up turn back let's make a little bit of distance shall we not much. Let's just make myself a little bit flatter. Okay. Uh, my periapsis is clear. That's better. That's much better. Right. Minute to the burn. Let's get ourselves in position. Finally in space. Okay. Go. I feel I'm sat at a weird angle at my desk today. Maybe my desk is too low? I don't know, I can't work out what's going on. Alright, sweet. Okay, and I just kind of need to wait until they're at that lower point now. So, okay, so we know... So we know that if I do that, I definitely pass over them. Let's do that.
but it might be a while before that happens again. I'm not sure I've done this right, have I? I've done this very poorly, I think. Okay, they're roughly coming into view now. Oh, I should be going right over some of them. At least one, anyway. Why not? Does that not count? Oh, right, no, I did. it did count. I don't like this. Like, this is definitely not how you're supposed to do it. It's definitely not how you're supposed to do it. All right, I'm going to try this. I might actually have to send a rescue craft. Good job. But we will see. All right, I need to wait until they're on the other side again, don't I?
Okay. This isn't working, I don't think. Um, yeah. Even though... Like, I'm, I'm pretty bang on there. Like, I'm too far out, I think. To be accurate. Okay, um... Let's see how far you can get in, buddy. Oh, it should be enough. We should be able to pull this. Let's go land. Do 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 do. Boop boop boop. Oh, God. All of this just so I can build a bigger space. Uh, VAB man. So annoying. Right, hopefully my parachutes will activate as well this time. And slow me down. Come on. Come on. Which is a nice shallow entry. That's so slow though, 110 meters a second is so slow. At quite a high height as well, if I'm honest with you. Yeah. Yeah, there goes all of them. It's the other way around, isn't it? Meow. Whoops. Alright. Let's keep going. That's another one. <laughs> And there we go, right. That was frustrating, I did that the wrong way around. I don't, really don't know how that's supposed to be so slow. Oops. 
Right, even if we get enough, I'm going to have to be very careful to get the correct amount. Extreme protective shell. Really? Huh. That's quite a high. Although, okay. Let's have a look, because it wants me to test the skipper and the bobcat. So... Have a new one. So, uh, the bobcat can be the top one. Have I got any couplings? Structurals? Okay, so that's an adapter, isn't it? Got a big fuel tank. Okay, yeah, that can be. Good. That's good. That's good. I should have a bobcat on that. Oh, hang on. Uh, let's give you a heat shield and then a. Oh, not too big. Make it gold, nice, nice. Okay, let's put your thing on. Okay. Interesting. Right, let's put that back on then. Okay. So for the bobcat, I need to be very, very high up. And on a suborbital trajectory. Okay, that's fine. Let's do that. I just need to be extremely high for a suborbital trajectory. That might actually be better getting myself into orbit and then deorbiting. I mean, nothing I've got here can match this. Only needs two. Let's be honest. I don't. I don't think it needs that sort of. Uh... I don't think it needs four.
Okay, um, shove these on. How am I doing? Yeah, I can do asparagus staging. Sweet. Okay. So, for anyone watching, if I haven't already explained it today, as far as asparagus staging is very, very helpful. It allows you. It allows you to drain these fuel tanks, I can show you in a minute, but what happens is all the fuel tanks will drain, leaving this middle one able uh, to be full when you detach the side tanks. Now I've just realised that if this is going to require me to launch the skipper engine at a very low speed, at quite a high height, um, which I'm not really sure how to do. This is quite unstable. Um, just fly straight up for a little bit. Let's see what happens. It's very aerodynamically unstable there. I think once I get outside the atmosphere, it'll probably be alright. Let's get that up there. You know what we're doing. No tilting slightly. Okay. This really does need to go basically straight up. Alright. Uh, okay. So, yeah, this needs to be quite high. 33,000 meters. Or 40, but it's the speed I'm worried about. Like, I'm already well in excess of that speed. If I turn the speed off, it goes as well. Right, okay. Um. So let's just try going straight up and leaving the speed on, I guess. Maybe it's right. Um, yeah. Okay, yeah, that's gaining speed, but it's not overly excessive. So you can see over in the left hand corner where my mouse is, I actually don't know if uh, OBS is capturing my mouse. You can see your Apple apps is raising slightly on your maneuver uh, mode there. Speed's going up. We are also starting to leave the atmosphere. So I'm hoping. There we go. Let 
let me spin. Let me spin. So I'm slowing down here. Okay. Oh. No, I'm going up. Okay, let's fast forward time. Let's see what happens here. Uh, now I'm going down. See what I mean about the middle tank being full. Uh, that's really irritating, right? I don't understand why it does that. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. That should work. Yay! I got it! Sweet! Actually, going to pull this off. Uh, oh, between two AE and two ninety, that is extraordinarily specific. But okay, that can be done. Let's get you on course. This has been a sketchy launch. Good on you, Jeb. You are the best pilot. You are the best curvinaut. That's what you are right now. You have just entered space, buddy. You are the Kerbal Gagarin of Kerbals. Also, all of your surnames are Kerman, which, uh, Kerman which I assume to mean that you are every single one of you is related, which is weird, because that very clearly indicates that there is nepotism rife at the Kerbal Space Center and program. And I don't know whose fault it is, but I will get to the bottom of it. I will find you. I have a very particular set of skills. I don't. I'm only good at playing video games. It's literally all I'm good for. Right. Let's slow. We need to get myself on this very, very specific course here. And then drop out of orbital flight and bring it back into a suborbital trajectory.
280. There we go, sweet. Because it doesn't care about speed, just altitude and trajectory. So, if I bring myself to my apoapsis, which is extremely far from the planet. Retrograde. Done. Brilliant. Right. Okay, I'm going to once again attempt to land actually at the Kerbal Space Center, although that's going to be very difficult because obviously I'm doing this with rockets and whatnot. It's, it's mostly this is mostly down to timing. Um, and actually, I think I need to just pull it down slightly. And I think that'll give me enough clearance. Possibly, because I think you got to make sure, of course, that the planet is orbiting at the same time. And obviously, you've got to time it because you're not going to be here. It's going to be a while before you get here. Okay. Okay, this this definitely feels like I'm going to massively overshoot. But we'll see. Oh, it's not this landmass. It's the next one. Let's have a look then. Nice. I'm not even going to lie, I quite enjoyed that. And yeah, look at that, massively undershooting, unfortunately. I'm probably going to land in the mountains. So, we also need this bloody parachute thing. No, I honestly don't, I'm not sure about it. Except on a plane. Could do it on a plane. I thought I was going to land on the mountains, I'm not even going to land there. Hit 14. Oh, come on, slow down, slow down. No, it's 
still not going to be enough. Alright, it's going to land. Nicely, at least I haven't lost anyone yet. Oh, no, that's a lie. My ship has in fact gone out of control many times, hasn't it? Yeah, I do in fact remember that now. Okay, but I completed these two, so that's, that's good. Contract promises complete. See, not bad, not bad. I should get some money out of this. Hopefully enough to build up the vehicle assembly building, which will give me the ability to put more parts, more weight. Means I can go to the moon slash mun. Already been two hours. Alright. Uh, while this is landing, I am just going to go grab myself a drink. I'll see you in five.